How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Bright Report. We're back with Jody Azarelli's Rain Team, and we are up against. Ooh, there's a Quackaval on this team. Um, Kilowattral, Quackaval, Garchomp, Faradurath, Golden Go, and King Gambit. We've seen a lot of Golden Go King Gambit today. Uh, or this week. Um,. So, my own King Gambit seems pretty good here. Um, gives me a great way of hitting through the Fire Giraffe. Gives me a really good way through the Golden Go. I am so slow with names today. Um, and I have a low kick for my opponent's King Gambit. So, I definitely want to bring King Gambit somewhere. I don't know if I bring it in the front, but Jet Punch is also crazy strong here. Um, oh, wait, no, Fire Giraffe actually stops that, doesn't it? Mmm, that could be annoying. I don't hate... Uh, I do want to bring Salamence here somewhere. I just don't know where. Could I do it like this, maybe? At least be super weak to a Garchomp lead is the worry. So maybe I do this. Yeah, I think I like that. Yeah. I think that's fine. I don't think Goldango is that useful here. Nor do I think the Moongus is that useful here. I guess the Moongus could have been useful, but they've got a Killer Watchful, which can deal some pretty big damage to it. They've got um, Goldango, which can't spore. Um, although that said, I don't think Goldango comes to this matchup. Killer Watchful definitely does, though. I guess maybe I'd bring in Electric Resist might have been nice. Because I've no Electric Resists, but. And they usually go kill off for Goldengo. Okay, I'm surprised they brought Goldengo to this matchup, honestly. Um, here's the problem. <laughs> the problem is Killer Ultra can watch up my Pella because I'm not focused, Sash. Um, I think I want to flip turn the Killer Ultra and then I'm going to switch Pelipper into King Gambit, I think. I basically have to read that they hit my uh, Pelipus lock with T-Ball here rather than my Palafin, because Palafin really obviously wants to switch. Um, so I think I just don't give them the luxury of hitting me. Please T-Ball my Pelipper. I don't really account for Killer Water Lead at all. They Tailwind, okay, that's fine as well. Wind power, fine. Trick into... You got tricked. Palafin. Oi. Bonk. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> Holy crap. Kilowater is very frail. Um, I mean, I'm kind of forced bringing Salamence here, right? I do not have much of a choice. Wait, did we see wind power on this thing? We didn't. Okay. Um, I think Hurricane probably takes out from this range. So I'm just going to Hurricane this, and I guess I'll just kowtow the Golden Go. Pretty sure Golden Go wants to switch. Um, it's kind of pinned here by the King Gambit. Um... It's a pretty successful turn one. If they don't have Farrow Giraffe, then. If they don't have Farrow Giraffe, then I can just jet punch everything. I don't really care about having choice bags attached to my, um... My Palafin. Okay, I guess they're probably going Terra Steel here. Um, just to survive the Kowtow. Which is fine. I don't think they're doing too much damage to me. They could double up on Salamence, I guess. Oh, Endeavor Killer Watchful. Oh, that's not good. That's very not good. Oh, never mind, it's fine. King Gambit lives. What an absolute unit. <laughs> Bye. Jesus. King Gambit is so bulky. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, we would have seen Wind Power in this up tail one, though. Oh. Um, here comes Kowtow. Smack. No, 
Respectful damage. Um, that was a quack. Um, okay. I think I just sucker punch the quack. Um, I need damage on it, really. I could also just hard switch Pelipper here and preserve Intimidate, I think is not a bad idea. Yeah, I maintain that I sucker punch the Quack Um Your boy needs some damage. Okay, they jet the King Gambit, which makes sense. Stop the sucker punch damage. Um, they get their Moxie boost, which is a little bit annoying. And then, what you hit me with? Fish Go Shadow Ball, yeah. So this will do some damage, probably not too much. Never mind, that did way more than I wanted it to. Um, so Pelly is unfortunately just kind of dead. Um, I think Shadow Ball plus... I could intimidate this guy. Do I intimidate the Quackwaval? I feel like Aquastep might do it. Was that 57 damage? Um, I think if I intimidate the Quackville here, I'm probably fine. I think. Intimidate. I'm um, just going to Hurricane into this dude. I could also have one more turn of Tailwind, right? I could also Tailwind this turn, I think is a decent idea. Yeah, maybe I do this instead. Mm. I'll Hurricane the Quackle in case they double my um, Pelipper. Step into okay, the accident ments. That's fine. Um, I think Pelipper should still be faster here. Um, oh, they have Aqua Jet though. I didn't think about the Aqua Jet. Is that going to kill me here? Probably not, right? Um, let's have a look. Uh, maybe I should just go for the hurricane there then. I didn't think about that. The Pelly, I believe, is max speed. Pelly's not max speed. Oh, Pelly's not max speed. Oh no, I've fucked it. I've fucked it. I've fucked it. I've fucked it. Uh, I think I just lose her. Okay, well, Palafin will outspeed. I guess I just have to hope that Wave Crash kills. Um, the Lingo goes out. Okay, who's this? Faradraft, probably. I'm guessing to try and get around a, a Jet Punch. That was King Gambit. They just jet me, okay. Uh, I should have gone for the Hurricane last turn. I didn't need Tailwind at all. Ah, yeah, I didn't kill you. I mean, Hurricane would have done it. So if I've gone for Hurricane the previous turn, then, yeah, it's just King Gambit and... Um, Yeah, if I hurricane, it's King Gambit and um, and Goldengo versus Pelly and um, Palafin, then I'm fine. Like they can suck a bunch of my Pelipper to get a free hit on it, but then King Gambit goes down to Wave Crash, and then um because their Goldengo would have been stuck at minus one. I think I would have been able to take Wave Crash Recoil plus that. If they hadn't hit my Pelipper, Hydro Pump would have killed their Goldengo in the rain from there, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, I would have gone Wave Crash, King Gambit, Hydro into Goldengo. If they double my Palafin, I move for their Goldengo, I KO their King Gambit, 
Gold Dengo hits my power thing, like Hydro, I kill 80% of the time. Um, <coughs> and if they go after the Pelipper with their Gold Dengo, then I just kill them with my power thing next turn. Yeah, okay. So I should have just gone for the Hurricane there. The Tailwind there was greedy. I didn't need it. I did not need the Tailwind. Um, Yeah, that was that was just slightly lazy on my part. I didn't I didn't think the end game through well enough. Um, definitely could have had that. I just kind of decided not to. Um, hey, ah, Tondozo. Tondozo and Sand. Hold on, isn't this just great for our guy Palafin? I want to keep Pelly back end because I want to maintain rain here. It's not that important, but it's useful. Um, oh, yeah, why would I have Pelipper be max speed? It's not Sash. Stupid. Um, okay, so I don't know if comes to this matchup. I just don't know if I bring it front or back. Uh, does uh, does Salamis come to this matchup? Actually, maybe it doesn't. Uh, no, it's actually super useful into the Meowth Grotto. Again, Amoongus just feels kind of underwhelming here. They've got a Fire type, they've got two Rock Slide users. I guess it's decent into Meowth Grotto, right? Because it's got, yeah, Pollen Puff. And tank hits. It's got Spore. Maybe I do. Maybe I do this, 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 and this. That feels very slow. I don't know if I like not bringing Salamence to this one. Uh, let's do this. I maybe could have brought Salamence over Amoongus. Um, Amoongus is good in Dondozo as well, though. It's worth noting. I guess unless it's Terra Grass, in which case. Uh, in which case, I'm just kind of screwed. Um, okay. Let's see how this goes. Okay, they also don't need Titor, which is sensible. Um, mm, mm, mm. I mean, I think Palafin just goes into Kinjambit here. And Amoongus is going to go for a big old puff. I think is the game plan here. So Salamence actually would have been quite nice. Like, Terrasteel Salamence could have been the play here, maybe. In hindsight, that almost certainly was the play, but oh well. Kinjambit. Yep, okay, that's banded. Um, almost certainly. Hey, Rob Slide. Don't flinch my Moongus, please. Thank you. Bonk. So, I could suck a punch here. I think I'd rather go for an Iron Head. Um, or a Kowtow, one of the two. I could actually Kowtow here, maybe it makes more sense. I'm not scared of a T-Tar switching. I'm going to Kowtow, and I'm going to go for a Rage Powder here to get around a close combat from the um, from the dog. Okay, show me a Skeletor, which would be lovely. Probably T-Tar, though, isn't it? Ah, I was so close to pressing Iron Head. I should have done it. Like I said, I'm not too worried about Tito switching here. Um, yeah, it's close combat. It's fine. Low your stats. Ah, I should have gone for the Iron Head. That was lazy. Okay, we kowtow. That did not do very much. Um... I'm going to Iron Head this, and I'm going to Rage Powder again. Um, I just need to keep this Lycan Rock away from hitting my King Gambit. Because the primary mission here is killing Titar. Um, actually, I've actually gone for Kowtow this turn, because they're going to Terra Flying. Um, I could see this being Rock Slide and Terra Flying into Amoongus, I think is their most likely play. Um... I 
attack, that's also fine. I mean, head. I'm faster? That's a slow Tyranitar, holy smokes. Okay, last, we'll just kill my Mingus, that's fine. Okay, now bring in Palatin, I think. Um, here is Palatin. And they've got the back, they've got Meow Squad, alright. And I'm guessing Skeledurge. So I think I can pretty safely go Pelipper here, and I don't need to give myself any recoil. Yeah, I'm just going to jet punch the uh, Tito. Um, I don't know how that was. Maybe could have gone for um, Wave Crash Titar and Terra Grass. Um, Iron Head into the Lichen Rock. I guess Terra Grass and Sucker Punch also works. But I think this is fine positioning. Um, so if I can get rid of Titar here, then I win the Weather War. They don't switch, they're dead. Okay. So now it is raining. This is a simple fact, it is raining. Yeah, they tried to get me with a sash. Um, <coughs> they wanted me to jet punch that lichen rock. Um, the last is Tatsu. Why is that last Tatsu? I think it's a hurricane here. Um, not gonna be storm drain. So I guess I could just go for a wave crash. I'm just gonna wave crash hurricane. Fuck it. Draco comes out. Smacks Pelly. Maybe should have gone for wide god there. Well, that confirms that that's Scarf, which is super nice to know. Um, stop trying to use Endeavor, buddy. Not gonna work. Hurricane. Yeah, dead. Um, I mean, Rock Slide there could have put me in a slightly tricky position. Um, but if they Rock Slide me there and kill my Pelipper, then I go into King Gambit. I go Terra Grass, Sucker Punch into the... Um, Into the what am I saying? Um, well, I got here to get around rock slide. Um, and I'm going to jet punch the this guy. Um, punch. Such a stupid strong move. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Um. Uh, guarantee win here of wide guard and flip turn. Yeah. Basically, I don't want to let them go for a situation where I go jet punch, then they... Well, I could have gone jet... I could have just gone jet punch and, and hurricane there. I may have been overcomplicating things. Um, yeah, because if they rock slide, then I jet punch them, and if they don't rock slide, then I hurricane them. Yeah, okay, actually, I'm being stupid. I could have just gone jet punch and hurricane. Oh well. That's gonna be it for that. Yeah, that is that is gonna be it for this, this episode. Um, yeah, Palafin goes crazy if it gets into the right position. Um, it's actually a ridiculous Pokemon. <laughs> a lot of my building for um, for this series has been trying to find ways to not just lose to Palafin when Rain is up. Um, yes. That is going to be it for this episode. Um, as always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please do leave a like on the video. 
uh, sub to the channel if you haven't already, and go follow me on Twitch. Link to that is in the description below. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.